Breaking news, my lovely, wonderful people. Rufai Oseni has spoken into what is currently going on. Yes, he has spoken because Sim Fubara is beginning to take real serious steps, great, you know, great, going to great length to ensure that he weakens Wiki's influence in River State. Rufai Oseni has responded to Governor Sim Fubara's redeployment of Wiki loyalists from key offices. These guys have been, if you call it conspiracy, I don't think you are making a mistake against Sim Fubara to ensure that he does not have influence and the state is not able to carry out, you know, key, uh, you know, key position, key work in ensuring that there are, you know, uh, significant development and moving forward of the state. Um, Wiki's guys have stood their ground to become what we call a stronghold, ensuring that, you know, Sim Fubara have no say. However, uh, Sim Fubara in recent times have reshuffled the cabinet, which Wiki, uh, in his own wisdom, arranged to ensure that um, Sim Fubara is greatly monitored. Rufai Hosseini responds to this. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like or share, subscribe. Rufai Hosseini responds to Governor Sim Fubara's redeployment of key Wiki's loyalists from major offices. Prominent Arise TV journalist Rufai Hosseini has openly revealed his thoughts on his growing political unrest in River State via his own his own platform. Governor Sim Fubara stands against the FCT minister Yesom Wiki throughout the controversies that resulted in a, circulated, in a calculated recognition of the cabinet. Several commissioners have resigned from their positions as a result of Minister Yesom Wiki loyalist being removed from important position. This this significant removal is a sharp decline from the peace accord that the previous that was previously reached in Abuja by President Bola Metinubu giving to Sim Fubara and Wiki. Amidst the turmoil, Rafael Hosseini expressed his skepticism about the peace effect, stating that I am sure Sim Fubara have learned that it is useless trying to make peace with people who do not mean anything peace. I think he has made the right move. He's bold and is beginning to take the steps in the right direction. We told him before, maintaining integrity of his original statement, what you have done is good. You have started a great deal of work. We really appreciate that you are beginning to take a stand for what you see and you believe. It will make you have your stand in your state and be able to affect your state pos positively. Sim Fubara is beginning to make the right move. Everyone should wash out. I said it before that this man, there is a fire on the inside. He just needs the right channel to come out appropriately and be able to work and do what he needs to do. Enough of the oppression that has been instigated on him. He is rising up now and taking real control of what needed to be done. I'm proud of him. He has taken the right steps. So this is what is happening right about now, my lovely people. And everybody is beginning to watch. We want to know what the truth is at this point in time. As you can see, um, our very own uh, our brother, uh, you know, is beginning to rise up and say, you know, all that is going on is about time. Everybody, you know, look at things more carefully and ensure that the right things are done. Well, my lovely people, what do you see in all of this? What do you see? Do you think that Sim Fubara is making the right move and that the, and that the right things are being done? You know, so these are very, very, you know, important decisions that must be made in order to ensure, you know, that things move forward. And Rufai Hussein is just pointing out the obvious that he feels Sim Fubara is beginning to, you know, you know, is beginning to take his stand uh, because Wiki, as you know, before Wiki, uh, you know, becoming the minister, he ensured that he placed people in position to monitor Sim Fubara and to see to it that Sim Fubara does not go against his, you know, his directives in the state. And a lot more have happened. A lot of persons, a lot of people are beginning to watch out and see some of these things going on and saying enough is enough, you know, uh, you know. And Sim Fubara recently, what he did was. 
ensuring that he placed, you know, he placed, uh, you know, a wall wickets and guys. He redeployed them, weakening their influence. For instance, the one that was, for instance, let's say, uh, in charge of finance. He took him from finance to put him maybe in a place like education or just, you know, places where they really don't really have that much of an influence, saying enough is enough. You can't do that. You know, enough is enough. You can't do that. So these are some of the things that he has done. And uh, when, when, when he looked at it, he said, well, it is about time, you know, that, you know, it's about time you do the right thing and ensure that, uh, you know, you, you are taking charge. You must take charge because we cannot allow the same thing over and over again. So the things are beginning to line up quite nicely. And everybody's seen, you know, Sufim Fubara take his place, you know, as a governor and, you know, registering his, his, his position and his influence saying enough is enough. I cannot allow this to continue. Enough is enough. You know, so we can strategically position people and did all he can, you know, to ensure that, you know, that things are done in his, in his own way. Well, my lovely people, what do you see and how do you look at all of this? Don't forget that you have a voice and we all must continue to speak in order to ensure that, you know, those who want to destroy the nation are not encouraged to do so. Do you know that there's a lot going on? Godfatherism is true and is real. It's true and is real. They are all aware of it, yet they encourage it. Look at what the president did. Just look at what the president did. You know, he, 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 he ensured that he put people together. He ensured that, you know, he did whatever he could, uh, give, making a peace pass to say, okay, and this is what will happen. And you will be the one uh, you sign that this is the peace accord. And everything, if you look at that peace accord, favors more wiki than same for Barra. You're telling him to bring back the people who have gone. However, you're not saying anything about the court cases against him, the impeachment and all that. So the oppression is high. The words are there. And so what do we, what do we see in all of this? What do we see? So Nigerians, it is, it is you know, it is... It is important that we, we rise up to the occasion and we do all that is needed and necessary to save this nation, okay, in order for peace to reign. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe, click on the notification button so you can get all our latest news. God bless. Have a fantastic and a lovely day from us. It's bye for now. Bye-bye.